Yo, 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 what's going on? Came on here. So today I'm going to bring you guys the long awaited Sword Soul combo video with duality. Sorry this took long. I was pre preparing for locals and we went undefeated. So played Cyber Dragon. So spoiler alert, I guess. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll post those videos later on after this one. But I want to get, get this, this one out because I know y'all were definitely waiting for it. So thank you guys for 1500 subscribers. It's crazy. We're already on the way to 2K, bro. What? Can't stop the hype train. So I'll, I'll be streaming on this this channel pretty soon. Uh, I want to just get some things prepared and whatnot, and just because like usually when I'm home, I'm I'm, I'm editing videos and stuff like that. So I don't really have time to be like I'm gonna do this, do that, that. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm here for all that. Let's get into it. So show you guys some combos. These are just some combos that I feel like you should know for the duality stuff. You know what I mean? But yeah, so anyway, let's go. This is a very just basic one, very simple one. So you want to start off with um, activate your Ashuna first, right? Summon to the field. Now you want to pitch this to activate your, your Long Yuong. Summon out your Long Yuong. Get a token. Now here, you want to go Baron, right? Baron first, Baron first. This, this, is, this is very important, right? Summon Baron. Now you burn for 12, right? Here's where it gets pretty cool, right? Because normally, like without this, we would go a link away, blah, blah, blah. But now we have even more follow up. So now we can go duality by attributing our Ashuna to summon out our Yazi boy. Yes, sir. Yazi coming out here for the win. Now we're going to go Baron, target the pop. Yazi effect triggers. To summon out our Taya here. Mm, hello, Taya. So now, this is where we go Taya effect. We're going to banish the Long Yuong, right? Just to get our token here. And now, we're actually going to banish the Adara here. So we can put back. Our long you want right back to our hand and now if you wanted to you could go oh yeah 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 so now we're gonna go synchro summon these two right and we're going to make a boxia here no boxy effect because it's turn one obviously but we're gonna go Taya effect here Gonna dump the Moye. All right, and now that the Moye is in the graveyard, you wanna go boxy effect. Target self, target the Moye to switch targets. Obviously, if you really wanted to, like to keep it on the field, you could have just used the Ashuna, but I wasn't sure if you guys wanted to lock yourself into worms just yet. So I'm just gonna show you some standard stuff. So yeah, target, target, what places. Moye effect, reveal the Long you only that you put back your hand because of the Adara. And then you're gonna summon out token here. So now if you want see this if you play Chow Fang here, right? We could definitely make a Chow Fang, but I, I don't play Chow Fang at the moment. No biggie though, no biggie. Because we could do so much more here. So. Hmm. And you gotta synchro summon these two. And if you want, you can either go for. You can either go for. Since we're not locking the worms, you can go for a drag eye if you play it. Or just the standard uh, Shisha, which we'll probably do that. Chain link one, chain link two. So we're gonna draw. It doesn't matter what we draw. The blackout. And now we're gonna go search for the summit here. I think getting the summit's pretty good here, I'm gonna be honest. And now what if you want what you could do, you could banish your duality and put these two back in the extra deck. 
and then you draw a card. Again, doesn't matter what you draw, but you just have more advantage. And uh, we did, so we did draw the blackout. So normally you can search this out if you want to. So yeah. Uh, now, like you can actually continue your plays here if you wanted to. Like you could go, like you could go summit and bring back the Ashuna and whatnot, but there's, there's no point. But yeah, so like, that's like one cool play you you can use with, with duality. So like with the duality, you get the, the extra draw and you can get to one of your little sword soul guys. So either Moye or, and or Taya. So that's it for combo number one. Let's go with combo number two. Okay, combo number two, a little bit more of a better field-ish. Just you need one more card in your hand to actually you know, pitch, but actually, no, you don't, because you're, you're going to have a Moye draw, so we're going to put this back, actually, so boom, four card combo, so even even better, to show you the power of duality, so the only thing is, you have to open up with either with either Summit or Emergence, it has to be one of those two, no big deal, though, so there you go, Summit Moye, Moye effect, reveal the, the Long Yuong, get out a token here, Synchro Summon these two, into your she shall chain link one chain link two so here doesn't matter what you draw you want to get his search off at all times right so we're going to draw a card doesn't matter what it is but we're going to check ecclesia cool card that could be discarded and now we're going to search uh you could search for emergence here activate your emergence and get your iris or if you're, if you're scared of Droll, just search out Iris instead because it has Swords on my name. So theoretically, I like doing this because you'll thin out your, your deck even more. So boom, right? Iris in the hand here. And now we're going to pitch the Iris, activate the Long Yuong. Summon Long Yuong, get the token. Now we're going to Synchro Summon these two into a Baron de Fleur. Burn for 12. So now we're going to activate Summit. And we're going to target the Iris here. Bring it right back because it has a Sword Soul monster. And now we're going to go Duality. It's in the grave. Summon out your Dragoon. And now you still have the extra card in your hand that you drew off of your, off of your Moye for a Negate. If you made a dark, you could uh, shuffle back this in the dark to draw a card, but yeah. So that's just like another combo you can do. So instead of just ending off on She Shall and a Baron, you'll end off on She Shall, Baron, and a Dragoon that can't be targeted or just destroyed by card effects. So that's still pretty good. And that was only with four cards, so therefore you'll still have that extra card in your hand. So like a five card startup and whatnot, which we drew. Cool, Vashuda. So yeah. That's it for another combo. I like the combo a lot, actually. That's pretty cool. Let me show you. I'll show you another combo. Maybe one or two more. All right, combo number three, right? This is more of like more of my speed kind of combo because like it kind of reminds me of like synchrons in a way where you kind of like synchro climb and whatnot. Uh, just got to open up with these. Not well, open up with these, but just mainly like your main combo tools are like Moye, Duality, Apple Dragon, and a way to actually trigger off your Moye. But yeah, this is still pretty cool too. So what we're going to do here. This is very standard Apple Dragon stuff, though. So you're going to normal summon your Moye. Moye effect. Reveal said card, right? Summon out your token. And now here, Apple Dragon effect. Special that. Cool, cool. So now we can go... Uh, no, we can go Emergence after. It's no big deal. Because you want to search for a certain card. And this combo is going to give you like a really big field, in my opinion. So sick or summon these two. We're gonna go to the She Shao first, obviously. Chenik one, Chenik two, right? So it depends on what you do draw here. Like if you do draw a Taya and or a Long Yi Wong, your combo will extend. But if you if you don't draw any of them, you'll search them off with this. Okay, so you're gonna draw a card. So we drew the Adara, cool. And now we're going to search. So if we were to just draw 
the Longi Wong and or the Taya, we 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 could have had a we could have had like more protection, aka searching out blackout. But you know, no biggie. Now we're going to go emergence here. Emergence is a very cool card, and we're going to search out. Our Taya. Hello, Taya. How you doing? How you doing? So now, this is when we pitch the Taya to activate our Longi Wong here. Push a lot of Longi Wong. Get the token. And now, this is where. See, you could do so much here. You know what I mean? Like, you could do so much. You can Synchro Summit. So I'll put the token in so we don't mess up the combo here. All right. And now you can Synchro Summon these two together. Well, if you, so there's, there, the thing is there's different routes to actually do this stuff. So like you could do these two to make a 10 or these two to make the level eight if you really wanted to which I think we would, you know what? Yeah, let's do it this way. Boom, boom, right? To make the eight here, right? Then we're gonna burn our opponent for 12. And now we're going to banish the Apple Dragon. Stand, stand Apple Dragon plays here. So now our token. And now, Synchro summon these two into our Chaos Angel. And now this is where we go summit, target our Taya here, summon out Taya here, hello, hi, Taya effects, right? We're gonna banish. So the thing is, you can either banish a Longi Wong and or Emergence. One of the two doesn't really matter which one you ban it. Well, it kind of does matter because you want to try to trigger out your duality also, which I think you can still do that. It's no big deal. Because think about it, you could go into like a Baron, not a Baron. You could go into a level seven here, or into just like your your Boxia. But I think we're going to try to keep it nice and simple as much as possible. So we're going to banish the Long Yi Wong here to get out said Long the token here. And now we're going to Synchro Summon these two into your Dragite. All right. Your tire effect is going to Foolish Burial, Ashuna here. And now we're going to banish Ashuna. Ooh, actually back. Uh, where's it at, buddy? Where's it at, where's it at? Aha, so now you're level four. But again, now you are locked into worms. Not a big deal though. Now you're going to synchro summon these two together into a boxia, sure, right? And now you're going to link off these two, right? Into your shaman. Oops, I guess Shaman can come down here more. Shaman effect. Pitch duality. To put back your Shisha, right? Now, duality's in the graveyard, right? You can banish duality. And you can put back the two lights. And then you can draw a card. And uh, yeah, so like you can use duality in like 
a bunch of different ways. It doesn't always have to be like, oh, I activate it. You know what I mean? Because it's still like a good di discard fodder for your shaman. I'm not saying it's the best card to dis dis discard, but I am saying like it is a good option to discard for your shaman. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, that's it for the for the some some of the combos. If you have better ones or no any other oops, let me know. Um, some of the combos do actually vary depending on your extra deck. I will admit. So if you are running uh, Shishao, not Shishao, wow, um, Chao Fang over like a Chaos Angel, then you know you could make even bigger boards. But I'm not running it. I like this. So we still ended up on a Shaman, Chaos Angel. Grandmaster and a and a drag guy and we have follow up here for next turn. Then we're gonna draw a card. Look at that sword iris. Cool card. Cool card. Anyways, hope you guys did enjoy it. Like, comment, subscribe, share the video. See you guys in the next one, man. Have an awesome one. Peace.